Hi Aquarius, what we are going to do now is we're going to take a look at your ex-partner and what the heck is going on with them, what's happening in their life. You know, we do the soulmate journey for the soulmate, the groups of different soulmates as they uh, go through their journey, the ups and downs, the highs and lows, but we don't really focus in on the ex-partner. So this is for those of you who are wondering what is my ex doing? What is going on with them? And we will take a look at their current situation and I will also look at what their hopes and fears are as well as what's blocking them, the advice and the outcome, and then we'll take a glimpse at the future to see what may be in store for them. So right now, what's going on with your partner, with your ex-partner, we have the star card, the chariot, and the sun, which are really beautiful, beautiful cards. And, you know, the star card is about hope. It's about faith. It's about healing. And what I'm hearing for this person that you are interested in they have grown as an individual. They're healing. Everything that was hidden is coming to the forefront in them. So they're really being guided from above to take a good look at them. And what I'm, what I'm getting is whoever you were dealing with was a very non-committal person. They had great difficulty opening up to love, opening up to a commitment. And they're being guided through their healing process taking a look, all right? They're being spiritually guided through their dreams, through any any means that the universe is using to, uh, to connect with them. They are doing the work, which is huge, huge progress. And they're being guided to move forward in their life, to step out of where they were, when they were emotionally blocked. They may have felt trapped and stuck and bound in, an, in a prior emotional situation which was doing no good for them and absolutely did no good for the two of you but they're being guided to move forward and to really start a new beginning you know the sun is anything that was secret is coming to the forefront so that could include you as well right i mean maybe you were a secret they didn't keep uh, they didn't introduce you to their family maybe the secret was they really loved you but we'll take a look a little bit further as to what's going to take place with this person and right now let's look at what their hopes and their fears are okay so we have the four of Pentacles and we have the chariot again so they're hoping that they can open up and move forward but they're also fearing this as well and that makes sense right I mean for those of us those of you I know I've been there where it's I know what I want but I'm afraid to go I'm afraid to move forward and this is what is taking place in their life and it's actually not a bad thing at all yeah they're still not completely healed this is where they're at in today's energy so they're being guided to move forward but they're afraid to move forward so it's a mixture of both I want to open up and move forward but I'm afraid to open up and move forward so what we're going to do now Aquarius is we're going to take a look at what is actually blocking them not just from you but in life in general okay and this is related to love of course but we want to see what's actually stopping them from moving forward. So, yeah. Um, right now, if you want to click on the link below, we'll shoot over to Vimeo. We'll take a look at what's blocking them. We'll look at the advice and the outcome for them as well. And then we're going to take a quick, a quick, a quick, a quick peek at what looks like is going to uh, happen in the future for this ex-partner of yours. So click that link below and I'll see you on the other side.